Well, this was running a couple yeah, of years ago. Yeah, it can't run now. That's the problem, because that pipe has gone up from there to there, and then in the front. So just some background, folks. I did a really cool video the other day of this Rustin and Hornsby running. Um, if you have a look at Facebook, you, you'd see it running perfectly. And the last couple of weeks, we've had an incredible amount of crime. Um, we all know the issues that we have in this country at the moment, but unfortunately, it's starting to hit the RSME. And I'll try to keep my videos as positive as I can, but unfortunately, the RSME is, is being carried away. So this Rustin and Hornsby was running about a month ago, right? Yeah. It was running a month ago. They, they broke in. They stole critical components off of this Rustin and Hornsby. So it will never run again. You can't get the parts for it. Um, the guys at the club restored this. It, it ran beautifully. You guys saw the video how smooth it ran. And, and now it's just a static display. It is so sad. I mean, the, the kids could have come and seen a hundred year old Rustin and Hornsby run. And we used to run it quite often. And it's never going to run again because someone came and stole a critical component. And the sad thing is, Gary, that this, they stole a little piece of here. Then if you go down further and we walk down. Well, it's about every machine is a piece missing. They, they stole off oilers. They stole oilers off here. So again, another critical component because you can't get these, you can't get these oilers in. So here's another stationary engine that is just never going to run again. So that's one, two that's not going to run again. And this one we stripped because we're going to do the bearings. The Tandy we're busy with the bearings. This one's governor, which is brass, stolen. Oil cap's gone. So just to give you guys an idea, right, the governor controls the, the speed that the engine turns. So if the engine slows down, it gives it a little bit more fuel. So it works in the centrifugal system. Yeah. And she ran beautifully this machine. Yeah, I mean, it has like the two balls on them to control the, the speed. And now it's never ever going to run again. So anyway, we put our feelers out and the community came to the rescue. So we have two security experts that have sorted us out. Tell us a little bit about yourselves. So yeah, no, thank you. And so we, we're, uh, I'm Peter DeLonga, Michael, De, Michael DeLonga, we're, we're the owners of a company called Fine Automation. And we manufacture wireless GSM alarms and GSM control systems. And we actually came here last Sunday with our grandkids and I think it was five of us here and we were just having such a great time. A lot of people riding trains. And we were talking to Gary and Gary was saying, yeah, you know, he has a lot of crime issues at the moment. So, so Michael came to me and said, you know, why don't we just give you like an alarm system and, and put it in here because this place is such so, has so much value for the community and adds so much value that just to have it destroyed all the time is just not acceptable. And it just so happened that during the week they came in here and broke again. So so today we've been here putting up the alarms and, and everything's working. So hopefully that'll put a stop to to this right now. Hey, look, from, from the RSME, and I think I speak to the community as well, for, for the community. Thanks, guys. Seriously. No, I mean, what, what you've put in here, you've been here the whole day. You've put in all the alarms for us. Genuine. Thank you very, very much. No, just it's big, 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 yeah. we, we have to. I mean, we have to look after this stuff. Yeah. I mean, now we don't, you know, if a kid comes here, he, he doesn't see it move. Mm -hmm. Where previously, these things actually ran. Mm -hmm. And in actual fact, we were walking down here, and that one over there was running, and it's got Correct. a beautiful yes, heartbeat. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. A beautiful heartbeat to it, and now it's it's not running. Yeah. 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 It's sad. down there, all the carburetors have been taken mm. off. So anyway, these guys supported us in our time of dire, dire need. Because if if this place wasn't looked after for another week, I think none of the engines would run at all. So Jen, thanks, guys. I'm going to put the information at the bottom of the video. Please look them up. Please, please, please support them because they've supported us. And if any other community wants to give us a shout and, and support us and try and help us with, with the theft, you know, any suggestions would be welcome. Appreciate it. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Thank you.